Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your love short for this week. So it's going to be a short love reading. If it resonates for you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below. If you need to get in contact with me, let's go ahead and jump into this Leo. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, Leo, let's see what's going on for you. Let's put the deck. Let's see, let's see. Hopefully it's good energy. The Ace of Sword. All right, nice. Getting clear in your thoughts and your thought patterns. Some of you are engaging in sober living, therefore sober thinking. Um, now you're seeing clearly. I can see clearly now the rain is gone. You're thinking so clearly that it is now causing conflict or this is how somebody is dealing with you or this is some, how someone you're dealing with is thinking now. They, you know, maybe they had a lot of fog you know in their thought process they just couldn't put it all together it didn't make sense it didn't add up and now something is adding up in terms of um, how they're viewing you or you're viewing them could be dealing with an air sign gemini libra aquarius it says something is coming in fast here and someone's going to make some decision here i don't have to cut something or someone out in order to have a new start. Uh, the blessing of the universe is clear, concise, direct thought process with the Ace of Swords. The Two of Pentacles, yeah, somebody's gonna make a decision here. It's up in the air right now. No one is making the decision. They're kind of juggling it. What should I do? Where should I go? What should I decide? Um, it could be juggling two people. It could be juggling two two ways of making money, but this is a love reading. Somebody could be juggling two people. Um, it's not stressful or tiresome for them. It's actually, you know, fun or it's engaging. It keeps them busy. If this is two people or two relationships, the two of you could know about each other also. Um, it's like this person is trying to grow two relationships in two different places or with two different people for two different reasons. In, in, interesting. Nine of Swords. But it leaves another person frustrated, especially at night. I don't know if somebody works at night or they're night shift work or they do something at night or they say they're in the studio at night or they move something at night. I don't know. Somebody do something at night. And it frustrates the shit out of the other person too. And they can't sleep. They have sleepless, restless nights because they they know something is not right. They're going over and over in their head, conversation, movements, actions that just don't add up or, or just it puts them in a place of unrest or anxiety here. Somebody has an inability to cope with change or somebody's changing moods or shift change or sh change. I don't know, something, some shit changed in here. Somebody can't deal with it. The Knight of Cups could be dealing with um, a fixed energy, Scorpio, maybe even Aquarius. This person could do something nice for you, a nice gesture, invite you out, do something, want to sweep you off your feet, make you fall in love with them again. This person is in love with being in love. They like the newness of love here. This could be you, Leo. It could be the other person. I'm not sure. Somebody has unrealistic expectations in love, though. Once they they get the first glimpse, the first whelm of somebody being not perfect, then they're out of there. They're out, they, they want out. It doesn't work for them. They need to find someone new so that they can fall in love with them all over again, have unrealistic expectations, and do the same shit. The Knight of Cups is on a journey, on a quest. This person needs to learn stability. They need to learn people are human beings. Um... The Knight of Cups can go from doing a lot to fall in love, to find true love, to the person who's leaving the string of broken hearts just because they have unrealistic expectations. I don't know who this is. Uh, and then we have the Knight of Swords showing up here for us. So it looks like you're dealing with somebody from the past with the two knights showing up. Um... Dealing with somebody from the past. It got to a significant place. 
but it didn't turn into full on cohesiveness. We're together. It's going to be hard to separate us and to be apart. Could be dealing with someone from the past. Could be another fixed sign coming up. Um, Aquarius, somebody who's willing to do verbal battle with you and they're intellectualizing their viewpoint. Therefore, it's going to be hard to persuade them of anything else. And also, they know exactly what they're talking about because they thought this over and over again. This person is something of a wordsmith here. So good luck winning the argument with this person because they're determined to win. They don't have a plan or a course of action outside of winning. But they're definitely determined to win the argument or to persuade you to see something differently. The Eight of Pentacles. I don't know. You and this person could have been in some cycle over and over again. Could be off and on, hot and cold, up and down, in and out. We're back together. We're not together. We're back on. Now somebody's saying, I just need to work on myself. I need to focus on myself. I'm in therapy. I'm working on my business. I'm putting all this energy into me. What I was doing with you was not working. I don't want to do it anymore. This could be you, Leo, or the other person. So when saying I've given chance after chance, we've done this over and over. There's an energy of somebody listening to something over and over. Thinking about a person over and over. I don't know. This is someone is trying to penetrate the other person's energy field. Four of Pentacles. Because I don't know. The door could be locked, shut, closed. Somebody's closed off to this. Um, they don't want it anymore. They feel like the other person is domineering, um, possessive, jealous, clingy, toxic. I heard a covert narcissist needed to deal with deep-seated issues from the past, maybe even childhood trauma. Somebody needs to deal with some things that they have not dealt with and it's causing issue, it's causing, causing blockage in connections to where it can only go so far, but maybe the four of pentacles it doesn't grow beyond that. Somebody wants something back at the status quo too, whatever it used to be. That's where they want it. If we was friends with benefits, if I could slide through at night and come and do my thing with you, that's what I want. I don't want nothing else, okay? So please miss me with it. All right? Thank you. Queen of Pentacles, yeah. If this is the mother of your children or you're the mother of someone's child, this is how they feel. They want things to be back how they used to be. They don't want newness. They don't want none of that. They don't want it. Please. Stop. The Knight of Pentacles now. Yeah, this person, failure to pull the trigger. They're not moving. They're stubborn. They're stuck. They may be loyal to you to a fault or to an extent, uh, but you're not the only person. They may, your loyalty lies with this person or their loyalty lies with you, but you're not the only person, okay? Um, you're the only person who has the loyalty. You're the only person that they call home or your home base to them. Somebody's not moving. It's like failure to fire to launch. I don't know what the fuck this is about. Death card. Yeah, but somebody's saying, you know what? This relationship needs to be over. It needs to transform. Here's you, Leo, showing up, trying to be compassionate, trying to. I don't know, it's like somebody's like, we need to move this forward. And the other person's like, no, we need to keep it right where it's at. I like it where it's at. It's good where it's at. I don't want anything new. I want this. Leo could be trying to hang in there, be strong in terms of, in the face of adversity, in the face of not getting what you want, or having to work hard for it, or having to put the work in for it, having to be strong. In the face of uh, mystery or not knowing or unrest, page of pentacles here. I don't know. It's like um, there's a lot of uh, false starts with you guys. You and this person come back together and you rebuild. 
you solidify the relationship with sex you really like this person how they look but then there's an ultimate collapse of this connection but then you want to come back together this could be same sex this could be someone wanting to restore the connection here get back on the right path with this person they feel like this person is the right path this is their wish fulfillment somebody doesn't know how to come back to you they want to talk to you reach out to you to have again once again a new start they want to compromise and kind of come to an agreement um, they'll say anything and do anything to have forgiveness to let bygones be bygones to have um to heal this severed tie because they're hurting without you and they feel like you're a forever person in their life um they're seeing things from a different perspective and they're thinking about their future they're thinking about the part that they played in this again they want reconciliation they want to renew this they want to come back they want you to make the decision in order for them for them to come back they feel lost without you hopeless um devalued ignored neglected they're waiting for your return and they're waiting for your communication you guys may have children together if you don't have children together maybe they understand that the relationship broke down due to petty arguments just for the sheer fact that someone would not take responsibility or they they lacked maturity to take responsibility therefore it led to argument somebody wants to, again new start new start new start just want a new start with you new start please give me a new start sound like a damn broken record advice for leo um the high priest uh the hierophant go seek counsel in terms of this connection also get guidance of what you should do seek a high priest or high priestess someone who can give you guidance maybe even a male someone who can give you some clear um some clarity on about about maybe a masculine energy also if you're dealing with another masculine energy the high priestess here it says um seek to rectify the problems and the discord in this connection some of you need to go and seek help yourself maybe um therapy therapist or you need to tell your person this is what they need in order to come back to you they need therapy and yeah okay if it resonates for you leo please go over to the website book your reading there take advantage of the text question you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link thank you leo many blessings to you